Hey guys, I hope you're all staying safe and staying inside as much as you can. This morning, do you know what? I feel good today. It's really sunny outside and it's just like a really nice vibe. And I went for a little jog this morning. Um, I'm not used to jogging at all. <laughs> I'm like, it's not my forte, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah, just feeling good. And so I just went and um, I just washed my hair um obviously i've been wearing a wig recently so i've washed my hair and the wig too and i usually sort of do them at the same time and um so this video is actually sponsored by function of beauty who are a brand i think they're a fairly new brand actually i thought they're such an interesting company to talk to you guys about they do a range of different hair products and today i used their shampoo and conditioner i've been using these products for the last few weeks so obviously you guys saw a little clip of me washing my hair but i'll also cut in um, my hair after using these products as well if you're interested in hair stick around it's nice because i don't often talk about hair and different hair products that much on my channel and um i think a big reason is for that is because i'm very like i'm quite creature of habit with what i use for my hair and i sort of know what works and i don't often try like loads of different things but when i like looked into what like how this brand works and everything i was really interested in it and um i really wanted to try it out because okay well i'll show you the products first this is the shampoo and conditioner i've been trying to use like smaller amounts actually because I, I didn't really want to show you guys these products and the bottles are empty you know so um i wanted you to be able to see the colors properly and you know how it sort of looks when you'd get it more so as i'm talking i'll show you guys their website because it's such a beautiful website as well and it's just such a nice and simple easy process you can personalize your own formula for any of their products that they make they do shampoos conditioner leave-in treatments hair masks and basically you go on the website you just sort of complete this two minute quiz you go through it you choose what your hair type is if your hair's thicker more fine then you also um choose like what your hair goals are so mine were i've just got it up here i wanted my products to focus on deep conditioning to hydrate because my hair gets really dry my scalp gets really dry curl definition for reference because obviously i haven't talked about my natural hair that much on my channel my natural hair is like a 3c slash 4a so i wanted these products like mostly for my natural hair and then also like i could use them on wigs and things like that if i wanted to because then you also get to choose your fragrance which i loved because if you're big on scent as well then um it's such a big thing isn't it so there's they have different options they also have fragrance free i went for eucalyptus then the other thing that i really loved is that you can even personalize what it says on the bottle so i chose function of my curls so if you can see that I just think it's so cute and so like they just thought of every detail how lovely is that shampoo as well function of my curls and then what i wanted to say at the beginning was like i loved these two colors and i actually chose these two colors for the products you can choose from a selection of different colors a few more points i wanted to tell you guys about their products contain no parabens sulfates gmos or toxins which is amazing they're also 100 percent cruelty free and vegan i'll just show you what my hair looks like afterwards now and what i found after using these two is that my hair feels very i don't know how to explain it but extra clean like as if a lot of products i've used before have sort of left a little bit of a residue so my hair feels sort of very clean and just like easier to sort of comb through or brush through and also i find that my curls look really defined afterwards um which is always good these also come with pumps as well to make it even easier to use when you're like in and out the shower yeah i just love the concept behind the whole brand you can get 20 percent off your first order by following the link that i'll pop down below so i'm gonna go now yeah i don't know what else i'm gonna do today <laughs> <laughs> so we just got our Akado order um i ordered it about a week ago so we're so excited to have some fresh food because like I, I don't think i've eaten like a fresh fruit or vegetable for like for quite a while so i thought i'd show you guys what we got in our like quarantine lockdown haul um there is a lot this obviously is i didn't panic buy i didn't buy like loads of one thing i just sort of got more 
things that I think you know we can keep in the cupboard um, just in case etc I also went a bit mad because I think I was hungry <laughs> when I was ordering so I think I'm going to debag all of it and then I'll show you okay so this is all of the fridge bags um, and I'll just give you a little overview so there's a few like recipes I've had in mind um, to make over the next few weeks because you know it's like if you've got time to cook this is the sort of time you might as well try some new recipes I'm thinking about making carrot cake with Indy so uh, well and and or a chili con carne one that I make has quite a lot of carrot in it so carrots courgette got this cheese to make nachos with and I'm really excited mascarpone because I saw a recipe that um, Melissa's wardrobe did that looked amazing so I want to try that um, kale spinach tomatoes what else we got we got some stuffing for like a Sunday roast and then protein wise we've got I doubled up on fish because I thought I can always freeze it so salmon cod I got these sole goujons which just look really good um prawns we've got some steak mango oh my god i want to eat this now they substituted the, is that a word <laughs> substituted <laughs> though the um stir fry mix and i'm a bit annoyed but it's fine so that's all the fridge stuff so i'm gonna put this away Okay, now we've got all of the cupboard stuff. Oh my god, there's so much. This is the bougiest thing I bought actually in the shop. I got some garlic and chili sea salt. I got some brioche burger buns to make some sort of at home fancy, well, hopefully fancy burgers, but veggie. Um, what else? Got new instant coffee because our coffee machine is broken, which is so <sighs> upsetting. <laughs> so I'm going to try that one out. Um, I got some bread flour because I might just try and make some bread because why not? A lot of tinned backups. And coconut milk, chickpeas, tomatoes. I got this tandoori paste because I thought it might be nice to make like a home curry. Um, I got some accidental wholemeal hot cross buns but I guess it's a bit healthier so that's good but I don't know how good they'll be. Um lots of my milk because that is now going to be hard to get hold of some pasta i got this book on amazon um i might talk about some amazon things i got actually later on bananas some tortilla chips for the nachos that i'm going to make at some point that's that so i'm going to put all this away now as well Yeah, uh, in there? I don't know, you might fall out. I like <laughs> I can't. No, I can't. What? It's all No, I told you. <laughs> so we're all sat in the sun having a little uh, trip to the cafe, aren't we, bub? How do you how do you share? <laughs> Indy set up her baby next to her and you got a biscuit, haven't you? With some of your coffee. <laughs> my baby's there, that's my seat. That's daddy's baby. We have Get down. coffees and biscuits. <laughs> Hey guys, I've just remembered. Oh, careful, Baba. I've just remembered that um, the like national clap Boy, for the guys. NHS. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Careful, careful, careful. Gosh, slowly. I'm is in, in the game. <laughs> is in like one minute, so I'm I thought I'd vlog us doing it. Oh, it's now, it's now. Oh. Yeah, you can hear the cheering. <laughs> clap, Indy. Good girl. <laughs> 
Can you do a whistle? I can. <laughs> You can try. We'll go. Woo! I can do it like you. Good girl. Look. Clap. Look. Should we clap again together? Yeah. And Daddy, do you? Why did it spin it? I think it was only for one minute. We're out on a little family walk of the day and we found this nice new path. Let me what new path. Hey guys, please ignore my dead plant. <laughs> this plant has just properly died over the last few days. I just put a bit of makeup on and I hadn't put makeup on, <laughs> like proper makeup for like maybe a week. So it feels so weird, but it feels kind of nice too. <laughs> um, so yeah um it's been a few days since i last vlogged just because we're sort of you know getting used to this new you know life and routine and everything and just sort of like getting on with it um and then some you know a lot of the time there just hasn't been that much to vlog um but i i was watching um nikki nikki's video on her like rearranging her whole cupboard like food cupboard and it really it, yeah it just made me get on amazon right away and like buy some <laughs> i'm so old but i love it some new tupperware um and i'm gonna like rearrange my cupboards and i think it's just gonna be a lot better and i thought i'd vlog it like i just thought there's no way i can do this and not vlog it because it's just gonna be so satisfying <laughs> for me and then if any of you guys like like organization and things and like before and afters and i'm sure you'll probably like it too i've been doing so many things around the house as well like i'm sure we all have haven't we but like today i got i just got like <laughs> i ordered these magic erasers on um amazon i have been buying so much on amazon like it's not even a joke yeah i was like <laughs> scrubbing all the walls down like a manic mad woman like <laughs> <laughs> cleaning all the walls and it's just great but i'm going to show you the two covers that i'm going to be rearranging and like updating um yeah so the first one is this one which is uh, it's just always a bit of a mess like look at that up at the top is usually is usually mostly like baking stuff so you can see there's like sugar flour uh, we've got I've got loads of rice I stocked up on it so there's rice up there at the moment and then that bit is usually pasta that bit is just like grains and instant noodles apparently um, snacks and then this I have this like tray that, which I put like seeds and um, you know just like packets of stuff it's just a mess just like nuts and seeds and, ooh, and stuff um, so it's just just a mess and woo. and then in here this is a bit of a, this one doesn't make any sense it's sort of like food and plates um so i think i'm gonna be making this one all food and then i'm gonna be put i'm gonna put i think those plates in there so it just makes more sense oh my god i've just realized that you've been on manual focus i'm so sorry if that was out of focus um, but yeah, up here there is tin stuff is made mostly here, and then yeah, just more tin stuff I guess, and like jars of pasta sauce. And I'm just gonna try and try and sort sort it out, you know. Um, in here, this is our sort of utility room. Um, I closed the door because the washing machine's on, and it might be quite loud. But this is all the like new Tupperware I got just from Amazon. I'll try and link it down below. <laughs> These are the magic erasers that I was using earlier. And then I've got some bigger ones, some smaller ones, and then I've got these big plastic trays, which I actually didn't realize were this big. I thought they were a bit smaller, um, but it's fine. I'm sure that will still work. I'm gonna start taking everything out and then I'll fill it up with the top, with the plates. Okay, whatever. I'll, I'll see you guys at the next step that I do. Why 
why do we have so much sugar? Oh my god. Okay, so that took longer than it expected. But here we have this cupboard now. That looks so much better. There's actually space. Um, so I've obviously put the plates, little bowls, big bowls, saucers there. Um, and then in here, I've got ooh, just like a lot of the smaller bits and sort of ingredients that I might not reach for as often. They're just sort of there for, you know, like any recipes that come up that I might need them for, like ground almonds, <laughs> like not, not often. Um, and, and also like smaller, like sugar that's I've only got a bit left of and things. Um, so yeah, that will go there for now anyway. And then at the top, I still am going to label these. I put a little um, like mini post-it on the top of each one too, so I remember which one each is. And then I'm going to um, put like labels on the front so that I can just, you know, easily see what each are. But we've got, so plain flour, lentils, um, the uh, self-raising flour, dark sugar, and I think that is caster sugar, and then some extra flours and sugar there. And then over here, this is amazing now, I'm so happy. <laughs> oh my God, look at that. So much better. So at the top we've got, we've just got, I think we bought in bulk loads of sugar cubes. We're quite bad with sugar, I need to eat less sugar, but um, sugar. <laughs> Look, I got this little um, pot from West Elm not long ago and we keep our sugar cubes in there for our coffees. To be fair, this sugar is really good in, in coffee. It's just like, um, is it Demerara? De Demerara? I can never say it right, but I just thought that was a really cute little um, like pot to put that in. I think it's actually, well, it says it's sort of for coffee, but we use that for there. And then at the top, I've just got some sort of that's a bit of a random area, sort of random things. Marmite, look at the mess. Tuna, um, uh, like flavouring, yeast flakes, um, gravy, um, just bits and bobs. And then here, apparently, like, honestly, I didn't realise I had <laughs> so many things from Biona. Apparently, I'm obsessed with Biona. Um, <laughs> I think it's because we usually get a cardo and it's um, like one of the first ones that pops up. But anyway, I, yeah. I've got like an array of tinned things and if I've got doubles, which I usually do have, I put them like behind each one in order. Um, I just like it nice and neat. And then some more sort of random things. I reach for peanut butter a lot, so I just keep that there at the front. And then I've got a lot of like jarred food and sauces and things. Just put those there. Um, I use these for indie mostly, and then I got these recently because I was craving, been craving tacos. So they're there. Um, and then my favourite part is obviously this bit at the bottom because it's all, oh, <laughs> it's all nice and neat. So in here, pasta is like we go through so much pasta, like just obsessed, just always trying new shapes and everything. And, I just live of pasta. So I put these really big shells in here. <laughs> Sorry. Um, macaroni, pasta in here. I wanna make mac, mac and cheese at some point. So I wanna use this pasta for that. And then in here, I just put a little Tupperware thingy of stock cubes. Cause I use that quite a lot when I make like dal and um, I don't know, stews and stuff like that. And then in here is for rice and noodles. I've got quite a few different types of noodles for some reason. I just seem to sort of build them up. Um, yeah, and then the quick rice and then normal rice. In here, I've put, our coffee machine's actually broken. It actually, we had to send it off to be fixed so it comes back tomorrow. But, so yeah, this is like the remnants of, of it, the bits we didn't need to send off. So for a few weeks now, we've been using um, just like Nescafe Gold, I think it is. So I just filled, thought I'd fill this up with that because just a bit easier, isn't it? And then in here, this is a bit of a temporary one. I wasn't sure what to put in this one, but um, I've put like cooking chocolate in 
and like bars and things and we got some smarties for a recipe I'm gonna be doing with Indy so I just put like all the chocolate and you know I don't know sort of snacky stuff there um, and yeah I'm so happy I don't know how long it's gonna like stay this neat because we're not really a neat household let's be honest <laughs> but I think these make it so much easier so yeah and then I thought I'd also actually show you um, some new additions I've m like added over the last few weeks. I've gone a bit mad with Lazy Susans and it is an, uh, wait, I just have to tell you face to face. It is an absolute life changer. Having Lazy Susans in your wardro in wardrobe, <laughs> in your um, cupboard. Oh, it's just amazing because you, for ages I was just like, stacking things you know like backwards and then everything would get messy and i'd forget what i had <laughs> and uh yeah this way it's just so easy to see everything hello <laughs> okay <laughs> so in here huh oh okay sorry your baby's asleep in. i've got um oils and vinegars Oh my god, I love it. Up there I've got sort of spices and things that I don't reach for as much. And then bottom one, like herbs and spices that I reach for most. Then one's like slightly less and then up there even less. Um, and then here we have, oh, this is just life changing. In this one it's like soy, like so dressings and flavour enhancers and things. So. Soy sauce, um, oh, love a bit of Liam Perrins, uh, Tabasco, Sriracha, um, toasted sesame, oh that should be the other one, sesame oil. Up here is things like honey, sweetener, um, agar agave nectar, um, just a bit of a mix. And then up here is, oh it's hard to reach but it's all baking things. So baking powder, etc. Um, and yeah, that's that. I also just rearranged Indy's. Indy's got this mini cupboard for her bits. And actually I need to type, this is one that's really messy. This is like smoothie cups and like protein powders and, and like bottles and then loads of cookbooks. <laughs> this I need to sort out, it's such a mess, but yeah. Um, oh my god, also, quick little random, like, shout out, I guess, but I got this um, blender recently because my old one broke, and I am in love with it. It's by Ninja, and it's, yeah, like, sort of touchscreen. It's just so good. I love it. So, I hope you like seeing me rearrange my shelves. <laughs> yeah, anyway, I'll catch you guys later. I need to start doing dinner. Um, also check out my insta stories because I've started doing highlights um, for sort of more things than usual because it used to just be like places I've traveled and I'm like obviously because we're all you know just stuck inside at the moment I might as well add a bit more content on there so I've got like general sort of quarantine things we've been doing I've got one on cooking like all the recipes that I've been making um, recently like for me and Indy too and um, oh, also I've started a film one, so maybe like film and TV that I've been watching. So yeah, check out my Instagram. Also check out my TikTok because I've started to upload on there too. It's just Sammy Maria. And yeah, I'll catch you later. Don't mix it yet. No, I will. Hi, Jasmine. Hi. Hi, Sophie and Izzy. Welcome back. We're doing baking with Anna on Facebook. It's like a Facebook live. We know we're going to be in a bowl. Here, I'll give you a little bit to lick. Give it a good mix. Great around the side. Great, you can send them to me or pop them on the Facebook page. I'd love to see some of you doing your baking. Your That's flour, so first we put the sugar. This is your job.
ways you can get into to cut your brownie out. So Whoa. Who comes to take wow. your brownie out of the tray? Yeah. I'm going to do a bit of that. I'm going to add it to my yeah. tray. You can so make you can it. Just pour it in. Good girl. Do it. Let's do it. Well, the, you're my tray. Look at me. Make a funny face. <laughs> I don't think you've ever, have you had brownie before? Right. No. Maybe no, your first brownie. Done. I should have asked Christoph, shouldn't I? Can I make it? Yeah. Yeah, go on. Okay, and then what we're going to do, we're going to put it on. One, two, three. Literally, swirl it round. One, two, three. On the top. Go. Now what I'm going to do is the rest of my chocolate Ooh, cake. No, don't I'm drop the shell. Let's drop the bubble. One, two, three. So crack. Crack. Everybody. And you're going to flip it over like this. How to prepare your brownie so you can enjoy it tonight when you're watching TV. So we're adding more teasers, Smarties. That's it here. Open it up for you. There you go then. And then now you can grab a handful and just put it on top and decorate it how you want. Good girl. Good girl. <laughs> this is the finished result. Mmm, I'm not a big fan of Smarties, but I'm excited for the more, more teasers. <laughs> yes, you can. Do you want to come up on the chair? Hey guys, um, I just came to the end of editing this and then I realised I didn't do sort of like a sign off or anything. Um, <laughs> it just ends randomly with like a big brownie that we made. Yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you liked this sort of mishmashy vlog. I think this was sort of actually over two weeks in the end. So I'm going to try my best to sort of make them weekly um, and a bit more like um a bit more structured to them i just find it honestly i find it really difficult like vlogging or like even just remembering to vlog with the toddler running around so parents that vlog it you are superhuman because <laughs> um i don't know i just find it i just find it hard to remember to vlog I think I'm gonna be like focusing the content more on vlogs, but if there is any like specific videos that you guys wanna see me do, um, or even like vlogs that, but that I sort of include, um, like a, I don't know, like a routine or new in, or you know, like a sort of topic into it, then let me know. Um, Cause I think that's a lot easier for me to do at the moment work-wise. Um, so yeah. Oh, this by the way, <laughs> I know my hair is like randomly really short. This is actually an older wig that I had. <laughs> so I like redid it, like restyled it. And um, I just felt like a change. <laughs> I do want to braid my hair again because it's, so, it's just so easy. So I need to get my hands on some braiding hair. If you guys know where to find any, let me know. Because I'm just going to look on Amazon, I think. But come check out my TikTok because I'm loving it over there. It's so fun. I'm having so much fun with it. Um, but yeah, anyway, I hope you're all having a really good day and staying safe and I'll see you next time. Bye.